notice anything familiar? Technology, man. It's replacing most human interaction. Although communicating on a regular basis, we're on our devices all day long. Let me show you how technology is affecting today's society. Matter of fact, watch this. Take the train, for example. One of the best ways to showcase this phenomenon. The ones that didn't feel like interacting much would be doing crossword puzzles, reading a book or a newspaper. Now almost everyone is listening to their iPod or playing on their phones. Only people that seem to talk are the crazy ones. <laughs> Look at this guy. Had it not been for an iPod, he could have started a conversation with her. Maybe even got a number. <sighs> Poor guy. Oh, and this one too. 24-7. Everyone is always connected to technology. Definitely not saying it's an evil thing. It's simply a great thing that is taking over human interaction. Shoot, listening to music while working out or being bored is fine. But some people tend to take it to the extreme and don't even know it. Simply talking to people is nearly impossible. You can't get a word in edgewise. We asked a few people what they thought. Here is their reaction. Well, except for a few that were too busy proving our point. This is it, people. The Galaxy S3, Blackberry, iPhone 5, laptop, iPad, TV, headphones. All those are ways of entertainment and communication that are both revolutionizing the way we use our time by aiding us in making our lives easier, taking away social integration. People everywhere are on their phones and MP3 players, endless, plugged in. Can't beat them? Join them. Well, I recently did. I upgraded from a Bieber to a Galaxy S3. What a leap. I love it so much my cameraman here even caught me on it. Well, I should have been interviewing some people. <laughs> nice job, Adrian. <laughs> this is some of the behind the scenes of the production. See the irony that's going on here? It's like I'm trying to get some work done. He's on his phone all the time. You caught me, man. Yeah, caught you. Could have done that a long time ago, too. <laughs> it's all right. It's all about now. What's going on, everybody? KB in the house. Live on location. Santa Monica Beach. Sunny California. And this is day three of Can't Get a Word in Edgewise. Thank you ladies again for stopping and sharing the photographs with me. Because the memories last forever. It's the toilet paper that keeps running out. You know what I mean? If you look over there, there's only one sheet left. How you gonna wipe your booty with one sheet? Now ladies and gentlemen, here's a question that I ask all my people. When is it the wrong time for your butt to start itching? Huh? I'm asking you, sir. When is it the wrong time for your butt to start itching? When you're in church, at a funeral? When you're eating? Or when you're being in the room? When is the wrong time for your butt to start itching? So you taking that picture with me? Come closer, take a picture with me. I'm not... Uh, yeah. Come get in the picture with me, man, with that million dollar smile, man. Look at you. Uh, we're rocking this party tonight. Uh, he's shooting his video. We're rocking till the early morning light. Oh, yeah. We're pulling switches. We're washing dishes. We're getting mama's kitchen right. Uh, make some bubble, yeah. Ah, uh, do the second leg on him. Ah, uh, yeah. Now, check it out. Where my bubbles at? 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 Ah, uh, we're rocking this party tonight. Mm -hmm. Rockin' till the early morning light Girl, yeah, we're pullin' switches We're washin' dishes We're gonna get my mama Another way that technology is replacing human integration is in tourism a lot of people like taking photos and sharing them on social media to showcase what they're doing and where they've been. Very fun at first. But you'll soon notice that the main attraction in doing any tourism is spent taking photos with your camera or phone and tapping away on your phone to share them. This causes longer memories, which is a great thing, but at the same time a slight waste of actual experience of being there. Even at concerts, people go there to have a blast, which they do. But now they're so busy holding their phones in the air recording what they should have focused on. All in all, the choice is up to the individual on what they're doing and enjoying more at the time. The whole point of this is to show how easy it is to get caught up inside the virtual world without realizing it, causing a lot of time wasted and face-to-face -face interaction lost. The best part about this is that you're watching it right now on your computer or mobile device and just realize you may be like one of the people we showed you. It's all good. 
and as ironic as the situation may be from making a video out of this using social media and devices to deliver it to you proves that technology is a great leap of integrity and evolution in society while at the same time having a plausible effect on isolating individuals behind a virtual world of connection and unlimited interaction causing an impeding division of the mass in real world and altering the way people communicate effectively. Can't get a word in edgewise. Can't get a word in edgewise.